Welcome back savages to another video. In this video we're going to be unboxing the Linkstock Helium Hotspot Miner and also checking the power consumption. Now I actually ordered a Nebra Miner back in April last year, batch 4, and believe it or not I'm still waiting, it's coming up 10 months, whether I'll get that Miner or not God only knows. So in the meantime I'd ordered this back in September last year and it just turned up the other day. So let's just go ahead and unbox this and see what we get inside. So a quick start up guide with a couple of steps to follow to get it set up. This is the miner itself. That's what it looks like. Quite plasticky. So the aerial will go on that bit there. You've got a LAN connector if you want to do it through Ethernet. Got a micro USB. And then the DC powering adapter goes in there. So next up, I presume this is the power adapter. Yep, so that's the power adapter you get with it, which goes in there. And that's rated at 12 volts two amps and you get the antenna as well so let's go ahead and get this connected up and just see how much power it consumes so when it's switched on you get a little red LED just here now in terms of power just booting up there it's about five watts thereabouts which is 0.034 amps so this isn't currently set up how I want it this is just to give you an idea of just how much power consumption this has got I will have it set up somewhere quite high up with the antenna um, but I just wanted to give you guys a quick unboxing video and just give you an idea of just how much this Linkstock Helium Miner uh, uses while it's in operation so anyway I hope you like this video please subscribe like and I'll see you savages on the next one